Hi Booktube, Lynette here and today is a long overdue second video in my nephew recommendations video. So you may have seen, I think it was right at the very end of, I think it was 12 months ago, I think really do think it was 12 months ago, I posted a video where I talked about um, books that my nephew recommended and at that point I talked about the Thomas the Tank Engine series. Today I'm going to talk about the second book that he wanted me to read for you and to discuss and that book is Which Way to Anywhere by Cressida Cowell. This is the first book in her series about the O'Hero and Smith children. Uh, they are a blended family and the O'Hero children have been sworn to keep their family secret, which is that they are all witches and wizards with different and various magical powers. The only thing that the O'Hero and Smith children agree on is their baby sister, Anna Peck. Um, however, Anna Peck is stolen by someone who is trying to get um, the map, a map maker, a um, magical map maker. And, and the O'Hero children have to go and rescue her, but obviously the Smith children are drawn into that as well. Uh, the map maker can draw any map and go anywhere within that map. Um, and if, like me, you were a child who drew maps, I did. I used to draw fake towns and I used to draw mazes and puzzles in notebooks. Um, this book really sang to me. By the time I got going and got into it, um, I thoroughly enjoyed it. And uh, the second book, Which Way to the Galaxy, I think it's called, um, my nep that's come out recently and I'm hoping my nephew ha will get his hands on a copy of that and read it and enjoy it and hand that to me to borrow as well although Cammy, if you're watching this I promise that I will not take 12 months to read it like I did this one so I actually thoroughly recommend this um it's really good it's really fun it's really imaginative because you are in a fake world with fake monsters with um mean characters uh, who are menacing and um, with other characters who are a little bit grey um, so I appreciated that that uh, there were characters who didn't ne they were neither good nor bad they just did what they needed to do at the time that they needed to do it um, and it was good and it was fun and I would if if my nephew hadn't handed this to me to read I would definitely be handing it to him to read um, because if you've got a child who is getting into fantasy, um, then give this book to them. I guarantee they will enjoy it. So that's book two of my nephew recommendation series. I'm sorry it's taken me so long to get to this. And I apologise to my nephew for taking so long to get to this. Um, I'm sure he has another book lined up for me to read. And hopefully I can get to that one a lot quicker than I did this time round. I hope you've enjoyed this video. Uh, if you have, please don't forget to like and subscribe. And um, I look forward to seeing you all in my next one. Bye.